back within a goal. Number 10 for Kristen Scott. Slots it right past. Offside. Just by the by, the goal for Anna Henderson did not count. She was offside. Meanwhile, Ali Moreno is in. Trying to get her. Loses it. Mallory Olsen. Tries to keep it free. Ref says play on. Opportunity for UCF on the far side. Here come the Knights towards the box. And trying to work around. Nice ball there. Hogan lost her footing. The defender still on the turf. And Smith will come over to clear it away. Great tackle, but also close. Right to Scott. Steps around a defender. Sends it across. And the Knights find the opener. Kristen Scott with the distribution. A beautiful ball in. Unselfish play. And the turnover turned into points. UCF strikes first. Right into the foot of Anna Henderson as well. And that's what I'm talking about, playing those balls into the box and then having to someone just fly in with all the speed. Let's look at this play development here. Not the perfect clear. Ball bounced around. She's got it. She passes it in. She runs in and finishes. We're getting the head coaching job at Ole Miss and has turned Ole Miss into a winning program. No, he's done a great job. I think they got everyone buying into the philosophy. The philosophy is that, again, the Rebels attacking here is Diana Martin with a cross. The shot and a goal. A goal for the Knights right off the bat. They get on the board as Anna Henderson gets UCF on the board and cuts it to 2-1. to one. Absolute massive goal. Obviously, the speed of Martin getting in behind. Good on self, which pass across the box. First time finish. And that is a big time goal to get themselves back in it. We talked about what do they need to change. Well, it's a personnel change. So, Anna Henderson on the goal from Diana Martin. The first goal allowed this year for Ole Miss. In the midfield, down number 12. There she is. Bradley had it knocked free. And Anna Henderson now. Up top, sends it out right, trying to get there, Sonia Holman. Holman taps it forward to the far side of the... Anderson, leading the way for Louisville. Up to Eckage. that's who you want to have the ball if you're Louisville. Now, Loner pushes in the attack. Looking for Joseph ahead. Bit of a wall in front of her, unable to hit her. So she's up to eight saves. Scott lofts it in. Nobody. Oh, what a save. Betcha Zaretta deflects the. The drive into the top of the box, settled down. And Dilgrain finds it at least initially. Look at this drive just a little bit wide. Anna Henderson. Right after. What a tough schedule so far for Temple. Absolutely. And considering this, this is a must win for Temple to stay alive. Here's Kristen Scott in the box. It's 3-0 to UCF in just over time. Down the line here for Mernon. Henderson now. Cross into the box. Scott is there. Scott scores. It's 4-0 to the Knights. Lewis and McFarland continue to have a very nice one-on-one -on -one matchup. As beautiful touch, me and Senyo with it continues her run. And Senyo out to Henderson, the goal scorer. Henderson sends that one across. Back post cleared away. One here by Watson for Henderson. Lots of options here. Henderson to the end line. Scoops it up. It's through everybody and then clear. Not. Here goes Egan up the right hand side, getting some minutes in here. Into Henderson. Oh, Henderson, good technique. Shoots, and that one floats up and over as well. Session for the Knights. Daria. 
Inside, oh, Olsen over the head of Olsen. Ball still def Yeah, drop balls are the worst. Um, and they've changed them, which makes it even worse. Yeah. Instead of you have to kick it, now you can dribble. That was loose, but nobody home to finish. Tumble for Asenho, but space for Huta. Over the top it goes. This is Anna Henderson, six in black. Defended well by Moxley. Henderson takes it back, though. Her cross... Ball's played in now. Henderson is out wide. Good turn by Henderson. She'll look for players in the box. Moreno is there, and it just goes on. Sent on the far outside for UCF. Here's Henderson. Inside the box. Can she clear in front? Still loose in front. And Ballsy comes out. Literally ran up the back of, of his stupid yawn and planted her face first in the grass. Couple opportunities for number six in the second half. Anna Henderson. Henderson turning on a dime. Reno. Reno onto her left foot. Crosses it into space. On the wing. Can UCF find something? A little crossover. This gets punched out in front. It'll be Henderson. There's the in swinger just over the head of Olsen and cleared out for the corner. Beautiful. Clock stopped at 421. It'll be Henderson. Curls it in. It's an own goal. goal! Originally from Kirkland, Washington. Played at Louisville. Now with UCF. Here's her in swinger. And it's punched away by Brisky. Able to bend that somewhere. You've got a lot more space to hit that ball over. Now Rajai is the right footer. It is Henderson off the bar. So, so close for. We'll see if the number 21 in black can find the target here against Martinez. It'll be Henderson. Oh, it was awkward. And Martinez sees it over the bar. First free kick and potentially the first opportunity offensively for UCF. And cleared away by... Affecting not just the goalkeepers, but the defenders trying to head it out. Now the wind is blowing out here as Henderson approaches a line drive, a solid head on it, but it goes... I'm sure she's going to be target number one, number eight. Well, Knights have Anna Henderson and Rajay Henderson... With the cross in the box and just. Jamise Joseph, quick cross right across the goal line. And nothing doing for NC State. Now Martin pushes ahead for UCF. And miscue on the pass. The steam for Deanna Martin and can't sneak the pass across. One headed off by a stupid Jan. And Brown can't handle it. Now UCF is away. Full breakaway for UCF, and Hasi's going to get a test here. It's Deanna Who's right there for the block? She doesn't make that block. That's a goal. Texas well, creating something from defensive play. Ball comes into the box, cleared here by Central Florida, but that was a huge moment. Put a circle around that in the second half. There's some great running out. Tonight, ECU. They are locked at 11 points. A long boot forward for Ellie Moreno. One of the first opportunities forward for UCF tonight. Moreno flanked out wide, marked by Matty Fiss. Moreno's cross in the middle. Rexford has trouble with it. With Scott bearing in, it gets through her mitts. Ole has them in the lead. Here's Vivian Bissett. Wagner laying off for Roberts. It's stolen by Mernon. UCF looking to get out on the break again. Mernon feeding Henderson. Henderson leaves it for Talia Gabara. One extra pass to Martin. Martin shoots Martinez. There to dive on top of it. Henderson had made the run and was lurking.